as the customer service and support is exemplary. Next up, we have Ben Pilgrim. With four stars, suspiciously. Yeah, well, very four. good, very good acting model with four stars. I think the one star could be one or two of two things. Either they think they are annoyed that they paid too much because there was a discount soon after purchase, or there's no water level indicator like uh, the in the app. That's Yo. the most common issues that I seem oh, to. Oh, they meant to press five, but but because it's a slippery keyboard. <laughs> Nothing negative, but very good, excellent, with four stars. We'll take it. <laughs> Thanks, Ben. <laughs> Ramo, five stars. Value, good value. Works as described. Wi-Fi is good, connected, no issue, and value for money. There you yeah. have it. Value for money. Yeah. I always, always think people's time is priceless. So valuable money. How much is your time worth? It's priceless. Next up we have Simon Hardware. Five stars, brilliant product. And Simon said, I have to say that the kettle gave me some issues initially when I was trying to connect to my workplace Wi-Fi. Workplace Wi-Fi is always a bit tricky. However, I need not have worried as the customer service and support is exemplary. The written information and YouTube videos should have resolved my problem, but when this failed, I was offered a replacement unit. However, it turns out that it was the 5G Wi-Fi that was causing the issue and I was unable to have access to the work, works router. I purchased a Wi-Fi dongle and the unit worked perfectly, integrating with Alexa and allowing full control from the Smart Life app. Thank you. I think I spoke to Simon, yeah, I remember that. It was that, Simon. Okay. I'm glad to hear it's like fully resolved now. Good customer service. Yeah, it's, it's something we couldn't, as I couldn't mention enough before purchase. So we put it on the website, uh, put it on the packaging and the user menu that you need to have 2.4G Wi-Fi. You can have 2.4 and 5G together, but you can't just have 5G. Um, and if you only have 5G, it, you can still make it work. And a solution is like what Simon has done, get a 2.4G dongle or AKA a Wi-Fi extender um, at 2.4G and, and it should get the product working. Uh, I think that in this case, like the access to the actual Wi-Fi was limited. He couldn't change it himself. So yeah, in this case, yeah, it's, it's a bit of a workaround, like it's a bit of a struggle, I suppose. Yeah, right? like same with, um, say, student accommodation, hotels, always a bit tricky. Yeah. Okay, David gave us three stars. Oh, no. And says, spout leaks a lot. Capital letter, two exclamation mark. Yeah. <laughs> this is great in most ways, but however much water you put in it, and I never overfill it, but the spout always leaks. Uh, I know, this is so annoying, but have you ever thought about maybe, just maybe, pouring it a little bit more slow? Basically, here, it is not like sealed, like many kettles. Oh, okay. But so, so if, if you, it doesn't matter how much water you put it in, if you tilt it at a certain, certain angle, the water is going to out. Is going to come out from 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 here. It is yeah. it's going to like spill. I'm afraid if you may, you can call it a design flaw. Mm. But then it can be improved. But um, I can only say um, at this moment you just have to pour it a little bit slowly and take your time. That's it. Bye.